Can tokens or fake quarters work to hack the high risk coin pusher? We're gonna test it today. All that and more coming up after this. Guys, welcome back to the Silver Strike. So today is packed full of all sort of information and fun. As a matter of fact, I thought about holding this off into a different video because the contents inside of the coin pusher itself is amazing. So let's just get to this one at a time. First off, today starts the Cash Bonanza event that they have here. A total altogether of $60,000. Now, inside of the coin pusher today, there's $30,000. You can't win it today. It's just what's inside of here. But however, what you can win is you can see the wallet that's full of a whole bunch of cash, gift cards, and whatever else that's in there. And also, they got these new purses up here that you get to keep after you win them. And that's got hundreds and fifties and all kind of other things. Plus, there's a stack of hundreds of actual hundreds themselves inside of there. All you have to do within 15 minutes is get it to obviously come off. There's two different options. 500 for 15 or a thousand for 30 and I'm not going to give a risk it today I need to learn how this is set up a little bit more so we're going to do 15 minutes the second thing coming straight from your all suggestions I asked you all to give me ideas of things to test and one of the things was tokens or plastic quarters could you use them to work so we have a several different ideas and methods to attempt but again say this clear as I possibly we can guys I have complete permission to do this I'm going to wait till after we're done I'm not really going to try to cheat uh, it's going to be done under the supervision of management so just keep that in mind but we're going to test this theory at the end and see can we work can we buy a bag of fake quarters for a couple bucks and use it to uh, hack a coin pusher all for entertainment purposes only guys so we're going to test that and last but not least guys I have an official video that's coming out here uh, probably the same day this video comes out but my book is finally done it's finally up on Amazon I'm so excited it's short should be packed full of a lot of good information this is actually not the final copy the final copy is up on Amazon so I'm super excited about that guys this is hopefully can give you all on the path to starting a career on social media link to it will be down in the description of the video if you decide to buy it you can do me a huge favor you can either for under five buck by the ebook version or for under 10 by the paperback and I told you if you buy the paperback and send it to me I will sign it and send it back to you I know I'm terrible with shipping things out but anybody that supports me like that I'll gladly do it also another huge way you can help me is Amazon's pack full so many different books if you can leave me an honest rating hopefully I'm not uh, putting myself up for failure right here but I think majority of you all are good people guys and if you could just leave me an honest rating on there that that way my book can be more seen but I, I have a whole video coming out about that I don't want to talk too much about it but so that's that so we got a lot going on today I'm super excited as I told you $500 got a bunch of quarters 15 minutes of time limit and uh, we're gonna go ahead and get ready and I have some other things I'll discuss with you as we go but uh, I covered just about everything and everybody's at this point saying shut up and just start <laughs> all right there we go so start leaving me a comment. Do you think tokens of various sizes, I bought several different size tokens, or plastic quarters will work to drop down inside the chute? Now there's some things I already know coming into it, but we'll, we'll get to that once, once we start that at the end. Oh, there we go. Come on, baby. This thing is full of cash. That's a big purse full of money. I've already won one of them on a video that I'm not gonna post because it was a terrible video. I haven't done that in a long time, but I just, it was not a good video. I ended up losing. It wasn't that entertaining, but I ended up winning one of those. And I use it now. 
for Flying J's videos and things like that. Happy Saturday to everybody. We got a traffic jam going on there on the right side. Uh, it's down. There we go. All right, that was a good. Uh, well, not as good as I thought. Ooh, that was loud. So I played it with Flying J's and boy, it was terrible. You gotta read some of the comments I got. There's a sucker born every day. Uh -oh. Just hammer it into me and I deserved it, guys. The only reason why I put so much money into it is just because I wanted to put a longer Flying J's video out. Something I haven't done in a long time. So yes, I, I pretty much can consider me a sucker after playing that, but I just basically paid to have a video, essentially. And showed you that thing is not winnable right now. Oh, there we go. Come on, baby. Come on, big push. Excellent. So it just has to obviously be off. Sorry, we are on the silver strike, so there is no loose cam on this one. I would just be looking at a black piece of plastic. We had one time talk about if they could take it off for me for videos, but it never went any farther than that. Come on, baby, there we go. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of money in there. And a whole bunch of quarters, too. Fifteen minutes is a tricky time period because usually it takes about 15 minutes to get the stuff up front. So I'm not banking on the fact that I think I can get that. I hope so, obviously, but. So I am heading off this weekend to go, or uh, this week to Ocean City for a vacation. Um, we're leaving Monday morning, so I will have a Sunday live stream. I just unfortunately will not be doing it on Facebook, and not unless I do two in one day, which is a possibility. I'd like to get all this stuff ready. Oh, there we go, baby. Oh. That's not how you do it. It's moving up, guys. It's moving up. Oh! And last quarter. Let me go down here and collect real quick. That was an amazing return to start off with, but boy, did that eat up some time. Man, I mean, it ate up a lot of time. I know you all don't really get a good idea of that unless I have the bonus hole going, but I spend sometimes a little bit of time trying to get the stuff out of the chute. I gotta find a way around that. I gotta find a workaround. baby it's moving up
So if you're watching this on YouTube, the link to the book will be in the description of the video. If you're watching this on Facebook, all you have to do is go on Amazon, keyword easy money, Joshua Bartley. And that'll take you straight to the book. You can pick whether you want paperback or Kindle. Fully up to you. But I really hope. Oh, also started a YouTube channel for it too. Got the first video up. Just for those that buy the book. That way if you have any more questions after you read it, go over there, leave a comment. And we'll answer it. Fingers are jamming up. on time too. All right, I have to go down here and collect. I am literally out of quarters. I'm just pure focus right now. All that weight makes it hard. That's why I said it takes about 15 minutes just to get up here. We're getting close on time, guys. Come on, baby, come on. It's like it's just seesawing or something. Man, it's just too much. 
much weight to get over top the lip. guys we're coming up on the last little bit I don't know that wallet might be a better opportunity to, to win than what those coins are We got about a minute, a minute left. Oh, shoot, playing sloppy. That's time. Well, shoot. Hey, let me put this down a little bit. That's how close I was to it, guys. All right, let's let's count up. Let's see what we've done, and let's test this hack. I'll be right back. All right, guys. So here we go. So you're not going to bully this. It always amazes me when it gets to something even. But in cash, I mean, it it was loaded. Our cash total for today was 400 even. Then we had $100 in buy-in chips, so that's 500, so therefore that is our buy-in. One, two, three, four. Oh, no, wait a minute, there we go, okay. One, two, three, four, that's 10. So 14 entries into the Bitcoin giveaway, and we got a $100 buy-in chip. So technically we're up 100 bucks with this, but still it's not as good. You've seen how close we were to getting it off there. I hate that, when all that cash is in there, it seems like it's a lot more than what's actually in there. But so close, if I would have done it, I mean, would it have been worth a thousand bucks? I don't know, is there a thousand dollars in here? I, I'm not sure. So we'll remember that for next time, but outside of that, let's go ahead and get, uh, Let's get started on this uh, hack. All right, guys, so I'm up here at the top. Let's go ahead and just to show you, I have a quarter, put a quarter in there. That's how it goes. So we're going to start off first with these tokens that I searched around the internet and this is the closest dimensions I could find, which maybe I could put it in a video or maybe not, but the actual dimensions of a quarter. But this is the closest that I could find. It's these like casino gambling chips. So let's see. See, I figured this is going to be a problem. Yeah, it's just big enough, just enough to where it won't go inside of there. I don't know, I don't know how much pressure it would take to. Yeah, unfortunately, this one is a bust can't use that and this is the closest dimensions I could find to a quarter as a matter of fact I thought it was almost exact but obviously I guess it's off just enough second thing plastic quarters toy quarters it's supposed to be a replica of the exact same size so let's get one out and let's see oh man that uh that won't go in there at all oh 
there we go. Oh man, see, same thing. So it's almost like people have thought about this already. <laughs> Could they have already thought that people would try to cheat, not just in coin pushers, but in like vending machines and stuff like that. So there we go. However, I anticipated this. Owning my own arcade, I anticipated that that might be an issue. So what I did was, got some uh, 400 grit sandpaper and a couple of the plastic ones and I went through and I started sanding it down. So now that it's sanded, let's do a comparison. Hey look, exactly the same to me. So let's go ahead and see if we can get it in there. Oh, oh no. Oh no, where'd it go? Oh, there it went, down in the field. Anything? Oh, all right, so I got another one. Let's, let's use this other one and let's see. Let's see if we can get this one pushed in there. Oh, down on the ground here, put that real quarter in behind it. Oh, it went down, but it didn't. So therefore, there you go, guys. I anticipate this is gonna happen. I've actually tested this Fury on my own when I owned the arcade. So I knew that what I needed to do was get plastic ones and some uh, sandpaper and just grind it down enough to work. And as you can see, it can work. Now with that being said, the fact that I was able to get this to work, guys, please never attempt it. I doubt it would work in a vending machine. I don't think they're heavy enough to do it. Obviously, if I tried this here, you can see the difference. As soon as you look at it, I would be kicked out, get in trouble for theft. I heard a lot of things that I could get in trouble for for attempting this. However, I have the manager right behind me. We anticipated this was gonna happen. So therefore, this just, I tested this theory because it came from one of your all suggestions to grind down a plastic piece and see if it could fit inside of there. So that's what we did. And obviously it worked. But as far as the tokens and the other uh, casino chips that they have, these are just too big. There's no, I mean, I guess you could technically grind these down but that seems like a lot of energy I would just rather go get an actual quarter and, and use that thank you so much for I hope you have a fantastic Saturday hopefully you enjoyed this is like our fourth uh, try uh, two of them uh, the recent ones have been from your own suggestions uh, one of the ones is put a quarter on a string so I'm not sure how I can attempt that maybe I, I don't know but maybe we can give that a try in the coming up but I said please don't forget about the book like I said I got an official video coming out about it but I would love for you all to get value out of this I, I really did spend a lot of time on it this is in no way trying to brag by no means and this is just I have seen the possibility if you put your everything into Facebook or a YouTube channel that you too can make whether it be enough to pay your car payment or it's enough to pay your house payment there's a possibility is there and I've trust me having the injury that I've got dealt with an EMS and not be able to work full-time anymore I've really put my nose to the ground and tried and uh, learned these so this is tried and true methods hopefully you all can find value in it have a fantastic weekend guys I will see you tomorrow for our live stream before we go and outside of that thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you soon